sorry, I'm, I'm talking about primary now, but uh, in primary schools it wasn't uh, accepted because we had we have a subject uh, uh, school organization. So children are only several hours, four hours in in school. So it's not easy. It's not it's not possible to implement this kind of approach in preschool. It's it's uh, it was much more uh, um, familiar with the way how they they used to work. So I don't know. We are we are still didn't uh, publish the new book, the new right? because uh, we are we are preparing. And to be honest, I'm thinking about uh, uh, removing the introductory part because it's too political. And if you are writing a book uh, about step by step from this political view, we cannot share it in Serbia because it's always, you know, like a bomb. So uh, that's always very risky, you know. It's always a lot of uh, discussion, pro and contra, um, mainly contra, with no uh, reasons, but it's on the level of attitudes. But I need to, to say something that uh, step, to add something step by step uh, really influenced our lives and our professional and our private lives, my for sure. And I'm so so grateful. And I'm remembering the first uh, meeting where we were meeting. Uh, after war and all these uh, painful, painful years, we were meeting uh, from different parts of ex Yugoslavia and start our work, joint work and our friendship. And it was really something. And then the circles were uh, growing, including uh, teachers, preschool teachers and our, our colleagues, even people from ministry, from faculty. So it was really really very important uh, opening door for all of us to to see each other on the feeling level, the level of emotion, but also on the level of joint learning and sharing and and this this is this is really very important. Milena, can I go back to 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 the new book or new mm -hmm. uh, new methodolo methodology? Uh, from of step by step, um, I think that if you will publish uh, the new book, let's say, it will be also one how to say proof that in fact uh, the new curricula, national curricula, was built on uh, on those mm -hmm. ideas. You know, so um, I think that that. Uh, Okay, you can probably, you have to ask Sara and Open Society, but you probably can skip the introduction, but still uh -huh. uh, you know, the, the, the essence of that book will show where are the, the roots of, of the step-by-step. Yeah. Step. Yeah. I, into, I added uh, a paragraph, uh, I, I mean the short text, about implementation in Serbia, just to to, to remember. And, uh, yes. yes, and then we expect a war between Dragana and uh, her colleague, the other author of the new curricula, and Tsip to, <laughs> to grow because it was really, but it's other other topic. But yes, we, we want to 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 be mentioned because it's it's really true. It is. Mm -hmm. Hurry up with publishing. <laughs> yes. I remember here. I remember something that um, Rada shared a lot, which was the idea somehow that because step by because. She tried, I don't know if this is how you would say it, but because she eventually convinced people from the Republic of Srpska to join the different trainings that she was doing in Bosnia. So first, 
the implementation of the program was easier in the Bosnia part of Bosnia and in the Croatian part of Bosnia with, I think, some help also from the Croatia team. If I remember, there were some trainers from Croatia who came over into Bosnia as well in the early days. But I remember she had a hard time getting traction in, this, in the Serbian corner of Bosnia, and she kept inviting people from that area again and again, from those cantons. And she said when they finally came, she, she found that they were, uh, that, that because step by step itself, it, because the trainings weren't political, they were a very open space for people to collaborate in a way. I mean, the values of step-by-step -step are the values of step-by-step, -step, but the trainings weren't about the nationalism somehow. Somehow she was sort of saying that step-by-step, -step, I mean, this is a good question. Is step-by-step -step political or was step-by-step -step a kind of non-political arena that everybody could communicate with and about and make friendships around? During this time, there was politics in different parts of every country. There were politics in different countries. But step by step somehow was a, a pedagogical space. It wasn't a political space initially. Actually, or no? You, do you agree or disagree? Anivis doesn't agree. Milena maybe agrees. I can't read Janana's face. I don't. I, I don't know her well enough. What do you think? Well, now I remembered um, uh, doing a social justice training. Mm -hmm in Iloc, its town that was, um, oh wow, <laughs> ah, I don't know if I should tell those, uh, those, those stories because they could um, uh, represent a um, uh, broader situation, but they are too specific, so maybe Whatever you like. We, we won't use anything you don't want us to use. You could tell us if you want us just to understand something, but it, it sounds like... Na Skypeu sam i ne mogu sad pričati. Ovaj... Well, uh, can you imagine the situation? Uh, the town of Ilok was not, it, it is close to Serbian border, uh, was not uh, uh, bombed. It was surrendered in a way that all the Croats took their bags and left the town. So the school remained working and people working in school remained uh, 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 receiving salaries from the ministry. And um, after the war, after the, the peaceful reintegration, Croats came back and they joined the school and they had to be in the same uh, school with colleagues who were working during the war while they were, while they were refugees. Can you imagine this atmosphere in school? Of course, they were not communicating, they were hating each other, it was terrible. And uh, we came with uh, social justice uh, training. And it was, I don't know, it was... Oh, I'm sorry. Um, I wasn't aware that it's still so. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I, I apologize. I really wasn't okay. aware that I cannot tell the story. Oh. Well, it was a kind of um, um, maybe it was so um, so impressive for me 
because I never before uh, sat in a room where people, where, where 